This is another uh, handmade sui bun. It's not porcelain, but it's uh, thin and delicate. However, it has stood up quite well. These interesting things are what is left on the Bismarck palm after the dates fall off. Uh, they're so anim animated. Okay. So Let's do it the other way instead. All right, let's try this again. So this uh, holds this, uh, these two bracts, seed bracts, um, in place too by its weight. Let me have a look at that. I'm going to pull a few of these out. If you have too many out it looks messy. It ruins the uh, effect of the mass. Uh, the shape of the container is taken away. I might tuck in some more even. So this is a nice negative space from where you are. And it's somewhat interesting there as well. So I would like this to be the main view. And I ma maintain the integrity of this area. I have a Ken's on here. And a uh, nice, beautiful colored cardboard palm. I'm placing this in here to uh, protect the fragility of my container and for ease. It's just easier to do it this way sometimes. I need to check that. That looks nice. It could probably stay just like this and be satisfactory. It has um, three main elements. But I think I would like to try adding something more. As you know, most Ikebana arrangements are uh, conceived to be seen mainly from one point of view, uh, unless they're intended to be a centerpiece or um, specifically to be seen in the round in some other circumstance. I'm going to use this, um, I'm sorry I don't know the name of this material, um, zebra-y looking material for a Kenzon cover. so that if you see it from where I am, that's not an issue. But I don't want it to distract from where you are and seeing this negative area. I'll have to check it again. That looks good. Oh, one more thing I could add. 
This is a Circuma ginger. You have to be very careful with this. This can distract. It will either work or it will not. Um, probably better shorter. Just to um, draw the eye in, give it a little more more dimension on the top. There you have it. These are the adjustments I've made. I trimmed these from back in here to open this space up more. And I moved this uh, stem over more. And I adjusted a few of these for a little more volume. And I, I think it's a clearer picture now. And it works from a slightly different angle the best. But um, I think it's interesting from all around. Here it is again. Took out the flower, just could not make it work. It was ruining that back uh, space that I like so much. And I think this is a much better version of it. Thank you. And from the other side, I'm going to turn it a little bit more. I know you've been seeing this, uh, and I keep on using it uh, because it is so uh, versatile. Uh, this uh, frond or uh, fruit uh, limb is uh, immature. It will never bear fruit because it's been whacked. But um, I love the color of it and the uh, resilience of it and the line. So I'm going to uh, emphasize the line and this mass. Uh, I have cut the bottom of this at a certain angle to go along the uh, flat 
portion of the container. And uh, I think I'll start with these mainly in. And maybe we'll change it a bit later. We'll have to see how it looks. Okay, that seems to be fairly well balanced. Oh, I wanted to bring in another player. This, of course, is the cardboard palm leaf. It's a much smaller variety that, that doesn't uh, get more than five or six feet high at the most. Maybe a little more. I have put this, uh, pre-inserted this because I really had to pound it into this cup Kenzan. So um, I'm just going to place this right behind here in a little nook that this container so heavily has for me. Fill that. I love the color of this. Uh, it's pretty, it's uh, it's on its way out. Uh, old things are pretty too. I have here. Let's see, a small piece of Song of India. I'm going to use this to kind of conceal the little bit of the Kenzan that you do see. Uh, this way it just kind of merges into the uh, stem of this. I don't want to hide the line of that. Well, a little bit's okay. And, okay, I have this beautiful thing. Um, they're a little more unusual this way. But, um, Although, like everything else here, except for this little guy, uh, these things are pretty well spent and on their way out. It's still beautiful, and it's pretty much perfect for what I want to do here. Oh, I see a little adjustment that we need to make here. I want to uh, unobscure this back branch, so I'm going to take this off. And this is a little bit too, uh, needs to be a little looser in the front, I think, still. I think that's the final solution.